Hey, today we're going to address how hot it gets here in this greenhouse. Uh, it's only about 70, 75 to maybe 80 degrees out this time of year. But man, it's been baking inside of this greenhouse. And, you know, a lot of the vegetables that we're growing right now, like spinach and kale, they really don't like the hot weather. So we're going to address that by putting some shade cloth on top. And uh, we actually got some from Harbor Freight. And we're going to put it over top and see what kind of temperature difference it gives us. Is that good? What are you eating? Kale. Kale. Eyelets are what's going to hold the uh, hold the bungee straps that I'm going to use, or the rope. It's going to be in turn held to the uh, shade cloth. I think these will work pretty good. They're not stainless, but they're probably like a zinc coated, so they shouldn't really rust right away anyways. I've got a few more holes down here to fill in. Ashley's busy inside right now, so I'm going to attempt to get this shade cloth draped over the greenhouse by myself, so we'll see how that goes. What I'm going to do is I'm going to tie some rope to it and just try to throw the rope over the greenhouse and hopefully uh, I can just pull it over without snagging the plastic. That's my biggest fear. I had to bring the drone out of the air. That was a little scary. All right, 
right, so a little bit of change of plans. I actually just took that shade cloth off. I have two shade cloths and I was going to be overlapping them. I think they're like a 12 foot by 20 foot and I was going to put the uh, 20 foot going over it and I would have had an overlapping seam in the middle which after getting the one up there I thought man that's going to be too much shade on there not let enough light through. So I'm going to change, I took it off, I'm going to change the orientation of them and I stitched them together with some uh, zip ties, kind of Frankenstein them. And uh, so, anyway, we're gonna attempt to put it back up, both pieces at the same time. This is exciting. <laughs> Not very sunny out today but you could definitely tell the difference between where the shade cloth is and where it isn't so I don't know maybe like a 50% change we'll see hopefully it doesn't affect the plants too much on their growth but man I'm telling you what it's a great time to have a greenhouse hey I appreciate you watching the video today uh, I finally got that shade cloth on and actually wasn't too hard to do by myself with that uh, rope just throwing it across there and uh, I got those bungee straps that are holding it on I might have to get a few more but uh, anyways if you got any comments or questions leave them below and like I said this is Harbor Freight uh, just basically a mesh tarp so we're gonna use it as a greenhouse shade cloth and see how it works we'll see in the next few days if it's not a little cooler inside another thing that's gonna help is we're gonna put a cooling fan in there or an exhaust fan that will actually uh, circulate or replace the air that's inside there so that's that's pretty much gonna uh, help the temperature drop uh, drastically so um, if you've got any comments or questions leave them below and again we do appreciate you watching subscribe if you haven't yet if you've done anything like this if you've actually used the uh, Harbor Freight mesh on your greenhouse uh, let me know how it worked out so We'll see you on the next video.